Hi friends, um, welcome to uh, today's um, topic of I'm new to oils, um, how do I use them? So this is kind of just an intro to um, getting started with your oils and there's a couple things that you'll want to get on hand, a couple different resources, and then um, what to expect in going through this FAQ group. So first of all, so you've got your oils, um, and now open the box. <laughs> um, just feel free to get started, get your hands in there, start playing around. Um, a couple of resources to pick up that are really helpful. If you go to the files tab on this um, Facebook page, you'll see um, I've got my oils now what plus recipes. And so what that is, it's going to be step by step um, how to get started and then two pages of different recipes that you could be using for common health um, needs. Um, another thing to pick up if you haven't already is I absolutely love the Essential Life. So this is sold through the um, through OilLife.com. You can also pick it up on Amazon. Typically, OilLife.com is going to be a little bit cheaper because it's their book, and sometimes people resell on Amazon. Um, and I always look to see if there's an older edition because that one's typically on sale. So pick up the um, a book, a good resource book is going to help you to know how to use your oils. Oil life or, um, the Essential Life also has a great app that you can use that you can download onto your phone. I like having both available. So I recommend having both this one to have in your home and then the app to have on the go. There's also a book called Modern Essentials that um, some people really like as well. That's gonna be very similar to the, the Essential Life, just a slightly different format made by a different company. Um, other resources to help you to get started is um, follow my Facebook page, um, uh, Stephanie McGee, um, Empowered Wellness with Stephanie. Um, and I'm always putting tips and tricks and education on there. Um, but then there's also a bigger group page led by some of my leaders in the company called Drop by Drop. It's a great place to search for different topics of interest that you can find where people have discussed before. Or if you've got a question, you just pop it in there and you've got over, I think it's over 2,000 people in the group who can quickly answer and help you to know what to do with your oils to help take care of whatever's going on in your home. So that's resources. Um, some things you'll want to get on hand at some point to get started. If your um, kit didn't come with a diffuser, you'll absolutely want to pick one of these up. I prefer the doTERRA ones just because I find that they're a little higher quality. But you can also find some pretty good ones on Amazon. But you'll definitely want to have a diffuser in your home. I'll have a video later on on how to use it, so stay tuned for that. Um, and But yeah, you'll just want to have a diffuser because using them aromatically in their house is one of the best and easiest ways to use it. Um, you'll also want to pick up some fractionated coconut oil. Um, you can use any um, oil as a carrier oil for diluting oils and we'll talk more about dilution and how to dilute in a later post. Um, but I prefer coconut fractional oil because it's got the fat distilled out of it so it's not going to stain your clothes. It's unscented um, and it's really great for your skin. So pick up some fractionated coconut oil. You can buy this through doTERRA. Um, or you can purchase through a number of different, I think I've got one other link posted in one of the posts here. Um, but you just want to make sure that it's high quality. Um, uh, just like the oils, you want to make sure that you're not getting something that's um, just not the best quality. Because if it's not the best, it's not going to be the best for your body. Um, you want to pick up some empty roller bottles. So this is just, this is a pre-made one by doTERRA. But they also sell on doTERRA empty ones that don't have labels that don't have anything in them and then you can make your own rollers so you want to pick up a pack of those so there's a six pack available on the doTERRA website um, you can also go to any um, essential oil accessory sites um, like oillife.com aroma tools um, or amazon i personally find that the doTERRA ones are the best quality because they've got an extra piece here that holds the ball in and they're made with steel balls so I prefer the ones that are sold through doTERRA, um, but you can pick those up just about anywhere and you'll wanna definitely have at least a six pack in your home to get started. So make sure to, to add those to your next order or to go onto one of those accessory sites and pick some up. 
Another great thing to have on hand is um, small spray bottles. So um, these, um, I don't even know if doTERRA sells these actually. Um, if they do, I actually buy my spray bottles through um, Amazon. So they've got a bunch of those. I find that they're typically pretty good quality. So just get those on, and this is just for sprays. I've got like an owie spray or a, a sunburn spray. Um, you can do air fresheners. You just, so you just wanna have a pack of um, sprayed bottles on hand, um, cleaning solutions, things like that. Um, so that's things to pick up. We went to three sources. Now just about the group. So this is the FAQ, uh, FAQ group. So this is just the top 20 questions that um, people who are just getting started with oils typically have. So this is the intro video to the group. Um, you want to go through the posts one by one. Be sure to use the um, the search tab to search for like post one, post two, post three, and each will be a different topic um, to help you to know um, um, what to do with your oils now that you have them. Next post is going to be on how to make rollers, spray bottles, and how to use your diffuser. So make sure to look for post two for information on that. Have a good day.